Hello everyone, uh, welcome to the iRobot Automation YouTube channel. Uh, in this video, we are going to discuss uh, the logical operation uh, execution using uh, relays, uh, using the FluidSim software. So, let us start with that. <coughs> means all type of logical operations can be executed using relays. That means without PLC, uh, without microcontroller, still automation is possible with only relays. That is, group of relays, a sequence of relays are possible. So let us discuss on that. <coughs> so uh, relay circuit. So we are going to demonstrate that uh, and logic. So and logic with two input. Uh, input A, input B, and output we consider as here H1. Okay, uh, input A and input B both are push button and normally open. That is uh, the assumption. Uh, normally open means like uh, uh, when it is not operated, it is considered as zero. When it is operated, it is considered as one. Okay, so there are four conditions here. Uh, in the first case, where uh, both are not operated, so output is zero. Uh, when uh, input B is on, but input A is off, the output is zero when input A is on but input B is off then output is 0 when both are in when both input are high then output is high that means when both uh, two buttons are operated then only output is on the application I will discuss in the class uh, what is the application of the AND logic ok but I am going to demonstrate how to construct the AND logic relay circuit using the FluidSim software So I double click on the FluidSim software. Okay, it's already there and time is over. Okay, fine. Only 30 minutes it is active. active. So double click on the FluidSim software again. Then it's open okay so go to uh, new file so there uh, go to electrical control IEC standard that is click on the plus mark then first take the power supply and in the switches section go to manual switches there you can find the push button how many required two so I will take two push buttons both are normally open and two relays are required so that is go to relay release then coil is there two relay means two coils So switches are connected. Now contacts. Contacts are available in general switches. Go down. They are normally open. So both normally open I am using. So we are connecting contacts in series. So that is the logic of and logic. And then actuator I will take motor in this case. Or you can take uh, LED also light indicator. but take motor here and switches now labeling so double click on switch 1 and I label it as A input A you can name differently also input B and this one I am name it as K1 that is the name of the relay coil K1 this is K2 and now this contact belongs to K1 double click and then select K1 
another contract belongs to K2. And this one is motor. So now circuit is ready. Go to the simulation that is click on play button. Now output is not on, it is off. When input A is on, output is not on. When input B alone is on, output is not on. When both are on, then only output is on. But here there is a problem in the simulation software. Since we have taken both push buttons, I cannot operate at the same time because I am having only one mouse control. Right? So for that option only, I will use one of the switch is normally uh, means push button, uh, sorry, not push button, it's a toggle switch. We'll use toggle switch, one of the switch. Normally open only, but instead of push button, I'll use toggle switch. That is input B, I'll use uh, toggle switch. Now in practical application, we can use only push buttons, but in the software only, we are using toggle switch. So I'm assuming input B is on, but input A is off. So I, when, I in, when I switch on the input A, then motor is on. See, when both inputs are on, then only output is on. So this is how we can demonstrate the end logic. And we we'll also put some text here. Go to draw text. It is relay. Relay circuit. And logic. You cannot uh, save this file uh, in demo, that is a limitation. But uh, what you can do it is, there is a control A option or drag and select means uh, area or there is a control A option, control A, then control C or you can have the copy function and uh, or take uh, the word file. the word file there you can uh, paste it okay so that you can submit as assignment here so in the uh, I'll give uh, the remaining logic gates as assignment so you have to submit in this way uh, and do some formatting center and then you can convert into PDF file uh, for example save save as so here you have to shoot select PDF this PC a location you can select then OK save so it will be saved as PDF file you can submit as a assignment ok so I demonstrate uh, how to construct and logic relay circuit in uh, uh, using a fluid sim software ok uh, Thank you for watching this and also uh, we will we'll have a discussion uh, means uh, for example uh, uh, 30 minutes over say if you are using software fluid sim software 30 minutes over okay, before 30 minutes get over what you can do it is say for example if you want to continue work then copy it so it will be available in the system okay once you copy it it will be available in the system if you even if you close the software again reopen it still it is there in the computer memory you have copied the circuit but uh, say that the circuit is very long it takes maybe one hour of time so what you can do take a new sheet and then paste it here see you can continue the work uh, even after 30 minutes okay so that is the one so this is how we can construct the circuit so thank you for watching this video uh, please subscribe to my channel we'll see you in the next video